Hey guys, today we're going to talk about the BL110. Well, we're going to talk about this bump cap that's right here. I've had a lot of people telling me that, um, you know, this spins, look guys, just hold it. You got to hold it with one hand and then you're going to spin this bump cap off. If for some reason this bump cap just keeps spinning and never comes off. Here's the problem that you're looking at, okay? I'm gonna show you. That screw in there, it's stripped. The plastic inside this bump cap is stripped. So obviously what you need to do is you need to buy a new bump cap assembly and I'll, I'll leave you a link to that. It's the MTD motor, I'll leave you a link to it. Amazon has them pretty cheap and I appreciate you hitting the link. Um, you. It's stripped. There's a nut. I don't want to let this go. There's a nut inside here, okay? And it catches. There's plastic. And over time, it can get stripped out, okay? So if that happens, you're in trouble. So, order a new one, that's great, but how do I get it on there? Well, <laughs> you're going to have to cut this off. So you can use uh, linesman pliers, um, dikes, and even a regular... Um, angle grinder or something like that, a hacksaw, I mean. Just want to add a little bit more clarity about when we're, when we're talking about ripping this bump cap off, okay? And there is a bolt head inside of there that, you know, the, the plastic's molding around. So we're really just trying to cut this plastic off and then we're going to need a wrench to, you know, back that out eventually. It's just that the plastic inside is stripped and not forming around the bolt head anymore gonna use tools like these maybe just start cutting into it ripping it off yeah if you're good with a uh, saw you can just kind of saw into it a little bit an angle grinder uh, just something like this is really cheap at Harbor Freight I got a video on it if you want to see it but uh, this will do it and then you can back that bolt out and then put on your new bump cap so I just want to be a little bit more clear give you a little bit more explanation about what we're talking about it's just this one piece right here just this piece right here you want to try to save all the rest of the stuff but you can order um, this entire assembly if you'd like uh, and then you can take it off right here so just up to you however you want to do it but you know the bump cap just take it off grind it off and then you can use a socket or something to get that bolt out hope that helps just be careful, do whatever you got to do and get it off of there, okay? And then, um, you know, order your new one and put it on there and you shouldn't have any issues at all. And remember, when you're doing these things, you always want, see that? That's a problem. You want to make sure that thing is popped out like that, okay? You want everything to go down, okay? So if it's, if it's not tall, if it's like that, and you that's not right make sure it's popped all the way out okay there you go so that's the major bump cap issue and a feed issue for the Bolens BL110 yes you're gonna have to destroy this cap order one first not a huge deal uh, 10 bucks maybe I don't know hell I don't know how much it costs um, you'll find out <laughs> So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the other Bolins um, we do here. And check out my uh, story. I got a little Looney Bin life story that I do. So follow me and just enjoy. This is things that come out of that. Just living a life here on uh, what we have. We got a few chickens. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and follow us. And just everyday life, we do it all. <laughs> Thanks.